Ryan, what's going on, man? What's up, bro? I'm 30 years old. And so, where'd you grow up? Uh, Orange County, partly, but mostly here. Mostly here? Did you grow up like... Too. Did you have mom and dad, brothers and sisters? Yeah, four sisters and one brother. My dad passed away. Your dad passed away. And your mom is still in this town? No. Where's she at? She went to Houston. She went to Houston. She left you here? Yeah, but I keep coming back. Oh, okay. Yeah, I just woke up here. So, so you were in Houston too? Yeah. Okay, and so then you came back here. Why'd you come back here? Well, because I needed to get off the street. So I came back here and my godmom said it was all right, you know? Oh, to stay with her? Yeah, oh, okay. she promised she wouldn't kick me out, you know? And then when I got here, I was going around looking for a job, right? And this dude said he was shoveling some rocks. Two days, 50 bucks, you know? First day, 30, second day, 20, right? That's what happened. He drops me off at a 7-Eleven to get trash bags in, in India. And then went back to my pad and stole some of the other pet goods. So, that's the type of thing. What do you do with that? Huh? Diabetic medication? Yeah. What do you do with that? Well, you can't get high off of it. Oh, shit. So like I see you're pretty high right now. What are you what are you smoking on? I said I'm mostly I just woke up. Yeah, sure. But uh but I'm, I'm fed, huh? gotta love that wop wop. <laughs> so you, so off the fed you gotta like you gotta have it every day or uh, yeah. What happens if you don't have it every day? Naturally, kick. Okay, so you start have having you a withdrawal. Have you ever nah, man, I've never, never had any of that stuff. It's nasty. Man. What do you, What do you go through? Like, what do you feel? Uh, I get all hot. I feel like somebody's easy. Okay. You know, people have told me they get like aches and pains. So like, does your does your family know that you're out here? Yep. And they know that you're like addicted to fentanyl. Uh, not really. So, do you see yourself getting out of this situation, or are you like kind of like no, just? I don't really think so. Every day. Do you want to get clean? Not so much clean, I just want a job. Okay. Like, I'm a fully functional you know, addict. Right. You don't think the, the fentanyl is affecting you too much? You don't think you need to get off of that? Nah, uh, because after I take, you know, the initial hit, take a five minute nap, I'm good to go. Mm. Pretty much. So, like, what what would help you out out here, like living on the street? What would help you out? Uh, place to live and you know, job. So you just wanna you just wanna, you just wanna work? Yeah. Okay. All right, man. You know, I'm not you, a bad guy. You, you mind showing me your your right there? Oh yeah, this is a this is a. Also, oh, if uh, like. What's that all the, uh, the, he's got a filter in the inside, you know, the little metal ones. And you pop this baby right here. Boom, baby. What's, what's that? <laughs> this is a, this is a, you know, bottle, you know, thing just to clean the. Oh, okay. And this is a scraper. Oh, damn. And then you got this motherfucker right here. Bad boy right there, bro. What is that, Lucy? What do you use that for? Uh, you use it. I'm trying to figure out how it goes on to here, bro, but I don't think it does. I think I just use that separately from it, this one right here. This shit is kind of. But I want to get a 
no silicone tip anyways. And you heat it up and you dab it. Dab it like weed, dog. Okay. Right. I thought that was how you smoked your fentanyl. Nah, 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 bro. Oh, okay. Yeah, you heat it up. The glass one or that one. You got the metal fucking screens in there. You got metal screens. You know, to catch whatever. That's crazy. So you have pure fetty. Pure fentanyl-y. With cooking it up and smoking it down. If your mom was to see this video, what do you want to say to her? <laughs> How about any like family members? What's up, Grandma? What's up, sisters? I got four of them, and one brother. So, what's up, yo? Bless the God family. What's up, yo? What's, what's up, man? Man, I got a huge Mongoose family. Do you? Yeah. A lot of them live down over there uh, in Anaheim. Yeah. Like I said, I used to live uh, in Orange County, Garden Grove area.